This morning Hilary got up and she cut up some fruit, so very happy about that. And I've got some coffee, so happy about that too. And I'm up a little bit early. I don't need to be out of the house just yet, so I'm gonna sit, relax, enjoy my breakfast for the first time in a long time, and just not think about anything for a while. Okay, boys and girls, we are about to leave the house now. By we, I mean me, it's only me. Stephen and Jason are in their cage. Hey, Jason. Hey, Stephen. Like I told you before, we just leave them in the cage while we're at the house. A few hours, oh. Hey Jason, he's shaking my hand. Anyway, um, gonna leave the house, gotta go to work. Two classes and a phone interview to do. Um, and what? <sighs> and probably a lot of other stuff to do, I don't know. But let's get this show on the road, let's get out of the house right now. Are you working today? Do you work today? When is your day off? Because right now I don't get a day off. I wanna know, when is your day off? Do you get two days, one day, half a day? In China, it's a little different with the days off. It's not the standard weekend, or, or is it? In some jobs it is, but at least in mine, it's not. Let me know, when is your day off? I'm always work now. Damn, it's hot. It's like 35 degrees or something like that. <laughs> Arrived at work now. Hot, sweating, stink. Speaking of stink, I got a deodorant. I'm gonna use that. Nice. Not nice. <laughs> it's break time. She's tired, so she wants to get coffee. Yeah. I am hungry and I want to get coffee, so it's time to go to 7 Eleven. Let's go. She's so cheap, she doesn't want to spend her own money, so I'm buying coffee from 7-Eleven. Bad! <laughs> coffee, some new Korean coffee and bread. And coffee and I don't know what she got. I paid. Why am I paying? Why? I've been conned. It's okay. It's just very small. For me, it's very small. It's my head. My head is big. <laughs> but it's okay. Just realized here it has a phone stand. So. Ta da! I can watch something. Maybe. Hey. Work is going to ruin my day again. station now time to go and go home and I'm gonna meet Hillary somewhere on the way so many escalators out the subway now I'm back home now I'm so annoyed. Thank you, Hillary. I'm so annoyed because tomorrow morning, like really, really early, there's an activity I've got to go. And it begins at 7.40 and it's after 10 p.m. now and I still don't know how I'm getting back to Beijing because I have to come back at midday because I've got classes in the afternoon. Why is it being planned at this time? You know, 
I always talk about doing things in advance, doing things early, on time, and why is everything always last minute? Oh, why, why, why? It drives me crazy when everything's last minute. I can do last minute things, I can. But there's no reason to. For some things, there's just no reason. This is something that could have been planned from the beginning of the year. And we're like making plans about what to do tomorrow and how I'm gonna get back to Beijing after 10 p.m. I have to be awake in six hours. Well, seven hours. I haven't even eaten dinner yet. <sighs> what a joke. So annoying, so annoying, so damn annoying. That's my phone. <sighs> Gotta get ready for another stupid message. So it is too late to really cook something. It's like 11 o'clock now and I'm not really that hungry, I guess. Even though I didn't eat lunch today. I didn't even eat anything really today. I just had some bread earlier and I'm gonna have bread again. Which is kind of stupid. So I'm gonna put these two in the toaster and this is gonna be dinner. Two pieces of bread. <sighs> that is life right now. Jason. It's late now. Good night, everyone. I am going to bed. I'll see you tomorrow morning at 5 a.m. Yay!